What's good guys, it's Combat here at Infinite Rhythm Productions, and this is the official tutorial for our brand new preset series, the Essential Series. So this tutorial specifically focuses on the Logic Pro X Hip Hop Rap Vocal Presets compatible with Waves Gold Bundle. Let's get into it. Combat, this is a banger, huh? When you guys first download your guys' pack, you guys are gonna get this folder right here. As you guys can see, we have our hip hop essential vocals, the README, and templates plus presets. Uh, the README pretty much takes you to this tutorial right here. There's also a nice little discount in there for our website, so make sure you guys check that out. So, the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go up here over here to our spotlight and we're gonna type in channel strip settings we're gonna hit enter so just to make sure you guys are in the right folder make sure you guys right click this folder right here make sure it's username music audio music apps channel strip settings you guys are gonna then double click track and all you're gonna do is drag in the hip-hop essential vocals wgb and then we exit that out now let's go to our templates and presets so as you guys can see, we have three different presets and templates for this pack. We have the aggressive Bay Area vocals, we have the LA Crisp vocals, as well as the New York Drill Warm vocals. Now the difference between these is exactly how it sounds. Bay Area aggressive vocals are just really aggressive in your face vocals. The LA Crisp vocals just has that nice crisp high frequency to it. And the New York Drill Warm vocals just has that nice smooth warm tone to it. And each one could depend on the type of song you guys have, the type of tone you guys are trying to get, or it could depend on the equipment you guys have as well. So if you guys have like a mic or, or interface that's kind of making your vocals or your own voice sound more like like uh, like muddy, more warm, more more in that midsection, the LA Chris vocals will definitely help bring up your highs and your frequencies to give it more of that radio effect. If you guys have more of that high frequency vocals or have a, has a mic that's very with the high frequency, high end type of thing, and you guys want more of that smoothness to it, it sounds a little tinny, the warm drill vocals will definitely give you guys that. And then the aggressive vocals are just great for any like straight aggressive hip hop type of thing. It's, it's just amazing. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna double click LA Chris vocals. And we're just going to let that open. All right. So when you guys open up Logic, you guys are going to get this full template right here. As you guys can see, we have our beat, our recording track, our lead box first, double ad lib, as well as our lead box hook, double ad lib. And if we hit X on the keyboard, it will take us to this full mixer screen right here. And you guys can see all the lovely plugins we have on each track. We also have reverb. We also have New York compression or parallel compression. We also have two types of delay as well as a little bit of a mastering chain just to give you guys that enhanced mix. So the first thing you guys are gonna wanna do is you guys are gonna wanna go to file and save as. So the reason why we save as is you guys don't wanna overwrite what we have right now. So this whole template the preset, let's say you guys do a whole song to this one template. What's gonna happen is is everything all the vocals all those settings everything you guys do is going to be stuck on that so you guys are going to have to re-go to the email to download that pack you guys just bought it's going to be a whole thing so if you guys save as every time you guys are always going to have that fresh template to work off of every time so we're just going to go over here to my desktop i'm just going to hit example one and we're just going to hit save awesome so the next thing we're going to do is we're going to bring in the beat like you guys are ready to record so i'm going to bring up my folder right here and i have my beat i'm just going to drag in my beat now let's play that out if you guys want to make sure you guys have the right tempo for everything, I actually left a nice little BPM counter right here for you guys. So you can just play it out and it'll tell you the BPM. Awesome. So it says 100 right here. So we're going to go up over here to tempo and we're going to type in 100 and hit enter. Perfect. So we got that right there. Now the next thing we're going to do is act like we just recorded some vocals. So I'm going to go over here and I'm going to type bring in the acapella onto the recording track. So I would recommend using this recording track to record all your tracks and then drag and drop them to the corresponding track. So whether it's the verse double ad libs or a hook or anything like that. These vocals are definitely overpowered a little bit. I'm gonna turn down the gain for them. I use vocals recorded at a home studio specifically to show you guys that even if they're distorted, even if they're not recorded the best or whatever at your home studio, I know we're not all recording engineers, we could still get really good takes or we could still get really good quality from the song and I'll show you guys here. So I'm gonna play this out like it was just recorded. You already know who it be. It's D Boy, but don't forget the BLC. I grow money, I just made a money tree. And me and Dime in this bitch until three. Fire. So I'm gonna drag and drop it to the lead Vox verse just to show you guys what it sounds like. Know who it be. You already know who it be. It's D Boy, but don't forget the BLC. I grow money, I just made a money tree. And me and Dime in this. You guys see how I lowered or raised it? I just used this fader right here. This bitch until three. Splurge, oh, keep on rolling out the P. 
Hey. Now, if I want to mess with the reverb or delay, I just hit the lead vox first right here, and I can toggle between the bus one, which is reverb, or bus three, which is echo. So I'll play that out. Don't who it be. It's deep, boy, but don't forget the BLC. I grow money, I just made a money tree. And me and Dime in this bitch until three. Splurge choke, keep on rolling out the P. Hey, say goddamn, ain't you hide, nigga. Awesome, so I got to where I kind of like it right there. Now I'm gonna hit Finder again, and I'm gonna go find my ad libs. I'm gonna bring these up. So let's just say you guys just recorded some ad libs over here. Let's hear them out dry. Hey, let's go. You already know who it be. Who it be? D boy, but don't forget the BFC. BFC. I grow money. I just made a money tree. So Goddamn. Me and Diamond. Awesome. Now let's bring that over to the ad lib track and let's hear the difference with that. Hey, let's go. You already know who it be. Who it be? D boy, but don't forget the BFC. BFC. I grow money. I just made a money tree. Goddamn. Me and Diamond in this bitch until three. Dimes. All right, so huge difference. And if you guys want to do any like punching in or anything like that, you guys want another lead verse track right here. It's super easy with any of these tracks. You guys could just hit Command D and it'll automatically duplicate that track for you with all the plugins and everything. You guys remember how we dragged in those channel strip settings a little earlier? I'm going to show you guys why. So first, we're going to go up to this plus over here. I'm going to hit plus. I'm going to hit create for audio. Perfect. It should open up this box right here, as you guys see. We have user channel strip settings and we're going to find the hip hop essential vocals WGB. Now, if you guys have a lot of our packs, you guys are probably going to have something that looks like this. So we're just going to click the WGB ones, waves gold bundle, and I'm going to double click. Uh, let's do the warm. So I'm going to double click the warm right here. Now let's hear the difference. You know who it be. Who it be. It's D boy, but don't forget the BFC. BFC. I grow money. I just made a money tree. Goddamn. And me and Dime in this bitch until three. Splurge Joe, keep on rolling out the P. Hey, hey, say goddamn, ain't you hot, nigga? Awesome. So you guys can definitely hear the difference with that. You guys could either change these same tracks or you guys could hit plus again, audio. And uh, for this one, let's try the aggressive. So we're going to lead Vox aggressive. I'm going to lower that. And I'm gonna drag this down. Let's hear it. You know who it be? Who it be? It's D boy, but don't forget the BFC. BFC. I grow money. I just made a money tree. Goddamn. And me and Dime in this bitch until three. So there we go. So you guys can hear the difference between the 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 LA Chris vocals, the New York vocals, as well as the aggressive vocals. So I'll go back to the Chris vocals. You know who it be? Who it be? It's D boy, but don't forget the BFC. BFC. I grow money. I just made a money tree. Goddamn. And me and Dime in this bitch until three. Dimes. Splurge Joe, keep on rolling out the P. Hey, say goddamn, ain't you hot, nigga? Shorty bust up in a wish you wanna slap. All right, perfect. So that pretty much concludes our tutorial. I hope this really helped you guys out. If you guys really like the way this sounds and looks, make sure you guys check us out on our website, www.infinitrhythmpresets.com. We have a lot of different series on there, from Pro Tools to Logic to even GarageBand right now. If you guys have any questions, please feel free to contact me on Instagram at combat underscore K. I'll make sure I leave my at in the description description below and if you guys could like comment and subscribe that helps me out a lot so i can continue to help you guys out let's get it